It's craft time. Today we're going to make biplanes. I have this biplane that I made out of a paper towel tube, or if you have a toilet paper tube, you can make a smaller biplane like this one. We're going to use the paper towel tube today, and uh, the first thing that you need to do is gather your materials. You'll need a paper towel tube, about three pieces of paper like this. You'll need scissors, and you need some tape, and you might want to have some different materials that decorate it, like crayons or markers. Uh, now, the first thing you're going to need to do is to take your paper towel tube and tape your paper onto the paper towel tube. I like to put a little piece of tape on the top of the paper and on the bottom of the paper to tape it on, like this. Now I've taped it onto the tube and I can just roll the tube around like this. And now it stays on the tube really well. I'm gonna put a piece of tape at the top and bottom just to keep it on there really nicely. There we go, pretty good. Now I'm going to need some wings for my airplane. So this is just the fuselage. You just need that paper again. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna fold your piece of paper in half one time and then fold it one more time. That makes a pretty sturdy wing. You need two of these to make a biplane. We're gonna tape that wing right on to the fuselage of the plane. So you need to get your tape again and then I'm gonna tape one right on the top like this. And it takes, I like to put two pieces of tape on to make it pretty sturdy. How's that? Now we need another one for the bottom. And I'm gonna line it up with the first wing so that it's nice and straight. It's already looking a lot more like a biplane. Now we need to, well, our wings are kind of falling down like this and they're a little bit floppy. On a real biplane, there have things in between called stays that help the wings to stay up. And so we're going to make our stays out of just a few little pieces of paper, just like this. There's a couple of them together and that'll make it nice and sturdy. I'm gonna fold the top and the bottom to make this shape. And that shape is going to be a good shape to hold our airplane up, wings up. So I'm gonna stick that right in between the wings like this. Hmm. If I just tape that on now, that's gonna make it a lot more sturdy. You can experiment to see if you like these stays to be closer into the fuselage or further out towards the edge of the wing. I'm gonna put them kind of in the middle. See how that holds up the wing? Now we need to have another one on the other side and that will make the plane really sturdy. Now you can think about if you were going to stand on the wing, where would you stand? Oh my goodness. That's pretty exciting. You could stand on the top of the wing or you could stand in between. If you were going to be a daredevil stump pilot. Fly on a biplane. There we go. That's much more sturdy. You can play around with that a little bit and make it just the way you want it to look. Now we need a tail for the airplane. And I thought for a tail, it would be fun to have a heart shape. I just cut out um, some heart shapes out of the piece of paper like this. You just fold over the paper <laughs> and then you can cut out the heart shapes. I'll show you how you do that. Fold the paper. You actually need two heart shapes for this tail part. So you can get some help with this part. 
but I just cut that shape right out and that's what I have. Now we tape that heart on the back of the airplane to make the tail. The airplane also has a part of the tail that sticks up. That's the rudder and that helps to steer the plane. They're very important parts of the airplane. You can use another heart, but keep it folded up for that part. Just tape that on. I'm gonna show you a trick that makes it stick up. If you put a piece of tape on one side of your heart and you stick it onto your airplane, it will be a little bit floppy. But if you take a piece of tape and you stick it on the other side of the airplane as well. Now your rudder is gonna stick straight up. Wait, is that the way we want it? Maybe the other way, let me see. That looks good. What do you think? Now you can use your airplane to do all kinds of tricks. You can fly up and down, and you can do barrel rolls with your airplane, or loop the loops, woo, and be a daredevil stunt pilot, just like Bessie Coleman. I hope you have fun doing some crafts. Bye bye